Agriculture is the main source of livelihood for 95% of the rural households in Lao PDR. Almost 80% of this cropped area is dedicated to growing rice. Rice is life for the people of Laos who have been planting and nurturing their rice fields for hundreds of years. But the land doesn't always give back what these farmers put in and with a country whose birth rate is the highest in the region at 2.5%, increasing rice production to feed their country is a high priority. In the southern province of Savanakhet, farmers' fields are continually at the mercy of drought and flooding. Unknown to some, there is a field here which has been privy to a specially bred Lao modern variety or LMV rice plant. เขาแตกตากันหลายแต่ผมกันลงชีวิตแต่ก่อนเฮาก็เห็ดแบบประถมประธานเขาก็ไม่อยากพอกินนั่นแหละไม่ได้ขายอย่างนั้นไว้เด
we have to preserve this for the sustainable use by the researcher and the farmers. To train people to identify and characterize those accessions and to use them in a breeding program, the Lao Erie Project has also supported the establishment of a training center out at the Agricultural Research Center at a village called Napok. I think uh, training is very useful. I have learned uh, English, writing, report, uh, how to collect rice for reserve in the corn room. The main thing before going further to disseminate our technology to the farmer, first we train our participants, we train our staff. Although Laos has attained national rice self-sufficiency since 1999, the rice sufficiency of the poor is estimated to be only 6.8 months in a year. In the upland environment of Laos, farmers' rice fields slope across the faces of the mountainside creating more challenges for researchers and the farming communities.